Today is half sunny spring weather. So I decided to test this uh, all power solar panel for charging this energy storage. Right now this energy storage has 0% of battery, as you can see, and they also has an app right here. Right now we are charging my 55 watts, 67, 60 watts. The sun came out from behind the cloud. So we will see how much and how fast we will charge from the solar panel. And the cat is also charging from the sun. It charged for a few hours. Now there is a shadow from the plants. So it is getting less power. Right now we get only 12 watts because of the shadows, also there are clouds. But I've charged it for a few hours. Here was 60% charged. So I will now analyze the data make a graph and see how much energy we gain in what time and what was the maximum charging power and more information. So uh, let's go to the computer. And now it's time for a cut to solar charge. Cuts also can solar charge from the sun. And here are the results. I wrote down each percent of the battery and at what time it was achieved and what was the maximum power between two percent values and I wrote down all those values for the test and make a graph and here with the blue line you can see this peak power between achieving each percent value and the orange one shows the state of charge and here I had the maximum power of 92 watts this is the maximum that I achieved during this test the panels can achieve up to 100 watts but the weather was just not perfect so I only got 92 watts and later there was shadow so the power started to drop and when it was under 20 watts I stopped the test the test lasted for around 4 hours and I've charged the energy storage to 60% during that time and you can see at the end it was charging slowly the start was uh, quite fast and later it was quite flat for the end so I stopped the test right here and here you can see the results of charging this energy storage using this solar panel in real scenario what you can expect from it 